Mr. Letard, and you're watching the Cat's Eye News. Do 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 do. <laughs> Hey Novi, so the Novi Unified Soccer Team had a game this Tuesday. It was a close call, but they lost to Northfield 3-7. But don't worry, they have another game, and they're versing Heartland on Monday, October 23rd. Please be there to support your Novi Wildcats. Hey Novi, Friday, October 20th after school, make sure you head down to room 182 by the Media Center for Culture Club. They'll be learning about the culture of Poland. Everyone's welcome and snacks are provided. See you there, Novi. Hey Novi, if you are interested in Novi Diversity, you should join the Novi Diversity Club. Their goal is to bring American ideals closer to liberty, democracy, and equality. If you want to join the club, please scan the QR code on the screen. Mrs. Moss still has seats available for the MSU Broad College of Accounting and Business Information and Technology Day on Friday, October 27th. If you're interested in going to business school, or especially if you're interested in majoring in accounting, this field trip is right for you. It costs $20 to attend, the bus will leave at 805 sharp on the 27th, and lunch will be free. Make sure you grab a permission slip from Mrs. Moss's room in room 218. It's first come, first serve, so you're probably going to want to go right now if you can. Hey Wildcats, Friday, October 13th at 3 p.m. in room 226, Dane is having a meeting. If you would like to, feel free to attend. What's up, Novi? Winter sports are right around the corner and boys basketball tryouts begin Monday, November 13th. Here's the schedule for freshman JV and varsity tryouts. To try out, you must be signed up on final forms and have a physical. If you have any questions about tryouts or open gyms, contact Coach Housie or visit him in room 132. Hey Novi, I've got some exciting news for you about German Club. Next Wednesday in room 247, they're going to host Oktoberfest. Oktoberfest is a party where you can hang out, eat food, play games, and even learn a little bit about German culture. It's super fun and I highly recommend that you come. And if you're interested in bringing your own food to make it even more fun, use this QR code right here. Again, it's next Wednesday after school in room 247. I'll see you there. This is Luke signing off. Hey Novi, make sure to stop by the Cat Rack during all lunches this week to buy yourself some special pink gear. You can pick up all of these special items and remember with the purchase of a $15 pink t-shirt you'll get free admission to the game against Northville this Friday. Proceeds go to the Pink Sisters, a Detroit based nonprofit that supports women with breast cancer. Alright Novi, so come get yourself some great gear and support a great cause. What's going on Novi and welcome to Cat's Eye Reviews. The first review we're going to do is Mortal Kombat 1. Let's get right into it. I think Mortal Kombat 1 is a great game. I think the storytelling is great. I think the characters are great. I think that the content that is in the game is incredible. Customization, I'm for it. It's a little, it's a little on the lower scale compared to the other games, but I still do like it a lot. Uh, it's, it's definitely not on Mortal Kombat 11 level, but it's higher than Mortal Kombat 10 level. The game is great. The combat is great. I think the vibrancy of the visuals is incredible. It's very beautiful. Definitely, I've enjoy, I enjoyed that a lot. And the multiplayer is fun. I think that I would give the game an 8.5 out, 8 out of 10. The reason it's not any higher is because there are some bugs that need to work out, some performance and optimization issues. But if they fix that, it definitely will be 9 out of 10. We'll see you later, Nova. Thanks for watching, Nova. Make sure to tune in tomorrow for the next episode of the Cat's Eye News.